November 27, 2017 712 PM PT Bakayla Kumari Upadhyaya The top 11 artists on season 13 performed live on The Voice tonight, all singing songs chosen by their fans. Coaches Blake Shelton, Adam Levine, Miley Cyrus and Jennifer Hudson ultimately helped their artists settle on the fan-suggested songs. First up was Team Miley's Janice Freeman singing Shine by Collective Soul. It was a great song choice for Freeman, who was one of the standout performers last week. She continued to impress with her powerful vocals and magnetic stage presence with her rendition of Shine, which had never been done on the show before. Lavigne said he liked Freeman's cover more than the original, and Cyrus was proud. It was a strong start to the evening. Next up was Team Blake's down-to-earth country singer Red Marlowe, singing The Dance by Garth Brooks. It was a solid song choice, one that was very in line with the other songs Marlowe has sung this season. But Marlowe really is one of the least versatile artists in the competition. He's an entertaining country artist, but he doesn't bring anything special to the genre. Shelton praised his storytelling. Cheyenne Jones from Team JHUD was up next. She sang Listen from Dream Girls, performed by Beyoncé in the film. It was an ambitious song choice, but her fans and coach clearly thought she was up for the task, and Jones delivered. Jones continued to impress with her range. Cyrus praised her lower register. Team Adams Adam Cunningham followed with a performance of American Girl by Tom Petty. Maybe coaches should take suggestions from fans more often, because it was another great song choice for the artist. Cunningham has gradually come into his own on the show, and tonight marked his personal best performance. He had to perform well considering he was in the bottom two last week and got the instant save. Shelton said he proved he belongs in the competition. Brooke Simpson from Team Miley channeled her pop power into Pink's What About Us The song was a great fit, and the arrangement highlighted Simpson's strengths. Simpson is another artist who has had a strong arc this season, repeatedly surprising with her confident covers. She made the song her own, and Cyrus praised her good ear. Team Judd Stavon Fleming sang I Have Nothing by Whitney Houston and yet another ambitious fan song choice that paid off. The arrangement was interesting, and Fleming showcased all of his strengths, especially his incredible range. Fleming's performance stood out tonight, and Hudson said she's watching him sing to the top. The Team Miley country singer Ashlyn Kraft was given Chicken Freed by Zac Brown Band. It was a personal best performance for Kraft, who brings something different to Team Miley. It wasnt the most exciting cover of the evening, but it was solid and well within her wheelhouse. Cyrus should really be playing up the fact that she has a strong country artist more and make a play for Team Blake voters. Team Adams Addison Agent sang Joni Mitchell's A Case of You in a stellar, emotional performance. Agent had a lot of momentum going into this week, breaking into the top 10 on iTunes last week. She delivered an understated but captivating performance that conveyed her artistry. It was another standout for the night. She is Levine's best shot at winning this season. Keisha Renee from Team Blake followed with a performance of It Matters to Me by Faith Hill. Renee broke into the country charts on iTunes last week, and she continued her country prowess tonight by taking on the huge hit. The performance was technically impressive, and she proved to be a strong entertainer, too. Renee has the whole package. Team JHUD was back up with Noah Mack singing Electric Love by Bournes. It was an eclectic song choice for an eclectic artist. Mac again applied his original music intuitions to the arrangement, and the results were striking. Mac knows how to produce himself, and that makes a difference. He is a very strong contender for this season's finalists. You owned the stage, Hudson said. Closing out the night was Team Blake's Chloe Kohansky, who sang Total Eclipse of the Heart. It was a theatrical but resonant performance that continued Kohansky's strong momentum in the competition. Results from tonight's voting will be announced live tomorrow night on NBC. The two artists with the least amount of votes will have to sing for the instant save. Who got your vote tonight? The Voice.